Welcome back. Now, Miss Heritage South Africa is looking to conquer the world. Serati Paleng is hoping to win the 2023 Miss Heritage Global to be hosted here in South Africa. The well-renowned beauty pageant, which focuses on promoting diverse global heritage, is set to take place in Limpopo next month. Miss Heritage Global brings together a new generation of young women who are proud of their roots and heritage and embrace other peoples as well. As a host country, South Africa will be welcoming over 50 participants with the hope that the crown remains in the country. For more on this, I'm joined by 2023 Miss Heritage South Africa, Serati Paleng. Good evening to you. Welcome to Newsnight. Good evening. Thank you for having me. My absolute pleasure. You look absolutely stunning. Thank you. And congratulations on your title. Talk Thank to us you. about Miss Heritage South Africa and just help South Africans understand what the pageant is all about. Okay, so Miss Heritage South Africa is a national international pageant mm -hmm. that is um, one where um, helps youngsters to um, basically um, learn more about themselves and improve themselves as women yeah. and um, yes so when when looking to go for the title of Miss Heritage South Africa what are some of the characteristics that you or the Queen uh, would would typically have I think um, for one be confident about who you are and yourself mm -hmm. Um, basically, just know who you are and know why you're doing this. Mm -hmm. Because most of us get caught up in not knowing why we're doing this, or maybe someone said, do this. But most of all, just know why you're doing it and do it for yourself. Mm -hmm. Because pageantry is not only about winning, but learning. Yeah, it's a journey. Yes, it's a so journey. talk to me about how you obtained this title. What was the, what was the process? Okay, well, it's quite an interesting story. Yeah. So I was scouted, mm -hmm. actually. I was scouted, and I was very privileged to be the chosen one. Yeah. It was a very tough journey. Um, you know how being scouted is. So, yeah, I was scouted and here I am. Yeah. I'm Miss Heritage of Africa today. So the exciting part is that you are going to be representing South Africa in the global pageant. And as I mentioned, 50 ladies from all over the globe will be coming to South Africa, Limpopo province to be specific. Mm -hmm. Do you know what the program will be like? What will be happening during that time? Yes. Um, by the way, the pageant is on the 23rd of September, mm -hmm. hosted in Limpopo and Venda. Um, basically, it's just going to be um, us competing, mm -hmm. the 50 plus girls competing. Since I'm the host girl, yes, I hope to be a good host. Mm -hmm. Of course, um, I'm the host girl, but we're also aiming for the win. Yeah. So I'm not only about winning, but also aiming for the win. And I just hope I'm going to welcome the other girls. Mm. And can you share a little bit about mm -hmm. where, which countries the other girls will be coming from? Do you know? Everywhere, mm -hmm. from Poland, Nigeria, Ghana, Gambia, everywhere. Beautiful. Yes. And then what, what happens uh, with regards to the global pageant? Is it a typical pageant where judging will take place and the winner is selected? Yes, yes. Okay, That's perfect. how it is, yes. And then when looking at Miss Heritage, you obviously are representing South Africa. What is the message that you want to put out there when uh, inviting the, the other 50 contestants here about South Africa and what the country is all about? And also, how do you plan on sharing a little bit about your personal heritage as what well? What I want to put out is basically putting out there that South Africa is a very united, diverse um, country and that's one thing I want to put out and stand for that South Africa is united and having the girls here is just to show that um, we can be one mm -hmm. we can be one yes, you know, we can be diverse yeah there's a lot of speculation around pageants and mm -hmm. and perhaps the purpose of pageants a lot of people might not see yes. um, the reason for it a lot of people are of the view that maybe it's just uh, a lot of beautiful women uh, walking on a stage showing off their beauty and their hair and their clothing mm -hmm. um, but a, a lot of other people are of a very different view and perspective that it really does instill uh, a certain ethic work ethic and confidence mm -hmm. Um, what is your view with regards to pageants and, and what would you say to, to naysayers who mm -hmm. feel like it's just a waste of time? Um, my view on pageants is that as young girls, it helps us a lot in improving ourselves as human beings. Um, I believe that it helps with improving your self-esteem. It can be anything, improving your self-esteem, improving your confidence, knowing who you are. 
and yes. Mm -hmm. mm. So with regards to it being Women's Month, um, in August we commemorate you know, all of the women that came before us and, and the work that they've done, but we also celebrate uh, you know, the women of today and how far we still have to go. There's a lot of issues facing young women in the country, gender-based violence being one of them, mm. um, access to education being another. As Miss Heritage South Africa, what are some of those vital issues that you think are important and how are you hoping to tackle those? I'm, hoping I'm sounding like a judge. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, Apologies. yes. Um, I stand for violence and women abuse. Mm. Um, it's, it's something very close to my heart. Mm. I've experienced it with people, my loved ones. So it's something very close to my heart. And I think it's something we should um, basically focus more on in terms of it being spoken about more, finding solutions on how to solve it, um, we should, us women should push into speaking more about this and finding solutions on how we can end it because um, you know how men, I don't, I don't want to, <laughs> I don't want to seem a bit off, but um, we should just as women push harder also because men are becoming too comfortable mm. in our world yeah. and society and mm. yeah, just mm. pushing this word of violence and women abuse, yeah. Hmm. So with regards to how South Africans can then support you mm -hmm. and show you love, there's a, yes. a voting yes. uh, mechanism. How do we support you? How do we vote? How do we show yes. you support? About the voting, um, there's a link to it. So about the voting, um, this is going to help me. By the way, mm -hmm. if I win public choice for the Miss Heritage Global, it automatically gives me a place in the top 10, Okay. which is something we're aiming for, which is something I'm aiming for, mm -hmm. and something I would love for myself, because like I said, we're the hosting nation, yeah. so we should go for it. And yes. So how do they vote? Uh, do um, they go to social media? Yes, do they go to social media. Okay. Um, you can follow the Miss Heritage website. Mm -hmm. There's a link that's going to be provided there. Mm -hmm. And yeah. Okay. And then just lastly, I read that there will be a concert. I don't know if you are aware of yes, it. I am. Celebrating global cultures and diversity. I think it's on the 24th of, of September. Just give yes. us some insight. What's going to be happening there? How do people attend? Uh, yes. And yeah. Um, there's going to be a fashion show. Okay. And um, people can buy tickets on computer tickets. And yes. And also. I'm going to be having a homecoming on the 26th of August mm -hmm. in my hometown, Limpopo, Pulukwane. Oh, so you're from Limpopo as yes, well? Yes, I'm from Limpopo. Okay, I'm beautiful. a proud young baby girl. Mm -hmm, beautiful. Um, I'll be having a home homecoming on the 26th of August and I'll be having a send-off on the 3rd of September, mm -hmm. hosted in Pretoria in Linwood. And I appreciate if everyone comes and supports me and yeah. roots for me. <laughs> well, there's a lot of people watching, so I'm yes, sure that yes. they will support. So, and if they can't be there in person, I'm sure that they'll go yes, uh, to the link on the website and support you by voting yes, for you. Um, but how do you prepare as our representative here in South Africa? How are you going to prepare to make sure that you are ready to represent us well? Well, I have a very strong team. Mm -hmm. I have very supportive family. They are rooting for me and they are going to make sure everything goes well. Um, no, there's nothing much to prepare, and I feel like we're already prepared. Mm. So now we just have well, to go for it. Well, you seem confident. I like yes, that. Yes. So now we just have to go for it. And yeah. Okay, well, I wish you all of the best in representing okay. us. We'll be watching. And hopefully, if you take the Global Crown, we'll have you back to talk about that accomplishment. Yes, definitely. So I wish you all of the best. <laughs> Thank in you so much. It's my absolute pleasure. And congratulations once Thank again. You. Well, that was uh, the 2023 Miss Heritage South Africa, Serati Paleng. And she will be representing South Africa at the global pageant that's taking place in Limpopo uh, in September. 50 uh, young women from all across the globe will be coming to South Africa for that global pageant.